everyone, welcome to Clem Dog Designs. I'm going to show you how to download and install mods into Planet Zoo. Uh, my zoo is full of different skinned animals, new species, um, all kinds of stuff like that. I have the uh, morph modifier turned up so that you can get more uh, variants of an albino melanistic. Just all the different types of animal skins you get in game. You can add that with mods. The mods that I typically install, I get them all from Nexus mods. So if you just open up your browser, type in right at the top right here nexus mod that's all you have to do it's n-e-x-u-s-m-o-d-s dot com should pull you this page uh, i will say one thing you have to do is sign up um, once you sign up you're going to get prompted to install what's called vortex vortex is the app that installs the actual mods into the game you download the mods from Nexus, nexus and then vortex is like an in-between and put them into your game file so you don't have to do it manually, which is a huge, huge time saver. The first thing you're going to do after you've signed up for Nexus mods, you can do it for free, but if you sign up, you get a lot faster download downloads. You see Vortex is opening right here. I like to have it open when I do this, so once you do that, Vortex will pop up, and we'll go over to that in just a second. But the first thing you're going to do, once you're fully logged in, you go over to Games in the drop-down, you're going to type in Planet Zoo. Make sure that you do hit the drop down because it's going to default be on mods and it'll just it'll kind of mess it up a little bit. So click games, hit enter, you're going to click planet zoo. And as you see here, this is kind of the new this week mods. You have the black paku, the red tailed catfish, uh, the tawny nurse shark. Um, but if you don't want to deal with that, you can just hit popular of all time. Uh, and it kind of shows you with more popular ones. You have to have the ACSC on for most of these reskin mods, so you're going to have to download them with this no matter what. So I would keep that in mind if you're going through. You can't just download those. Uh, like one of these mods, it'll say, uh, in order for this mod to work, you're going to need this. So make sure you also always download the ACSC. I'm going to go ahead and put that in the uh, description down below, just that link uh, to what it's called, so you guys can remember it. But let's scroll, scroll through here, we'll see if we can find a good one to put into our zoo. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go ahead and put, I already have a pretty cool penguin exhibit. We'll go ahead and add this little blue penguin species. It's for edition 1.12. This should be fine, no is issues there. This is a very popular one, it looks like. Uh, it's created by Leaf Productions. We'll go ahead and give him credit down in there. He has 490 mods. I have actually downloaded a lot of his mods uh, before. They're always good. They're always solid. Uh, there's a couple that have issues, but they're a little bit older. Um, so I usually try to down download at least 1.10 and up of his mods. Uh, the past ones still work, though. But we're going to go ahead and download these penguins. So you're going to go up here, see where it says download. You have two options. Vortex and man manual. You can do manual. Like I said, it's kind of annoying. So I would click Vortex. Now what's cool about Vortex is it will sometimes automatically start downloading. And we're going to pull Vortex up over on the screen right here so everybody can see. Now it didn't do it automatically. If it doesn't do it automatically, all you have to do is click download. And you can pull up Vortex. I'll make Vortex full screen now. And you see that Vortex is going to automatically install it as can be seen right here. Now because I have multiple hard drives, I have to elevate this. I'm gonna run pre-deployment events. It's gonna ask me like, hey, do you want this to alter the game? It's gonna take a second to load and then you hit yes. And you should be good, no issues at all. And again, it's a solid thing. We'll go ahead and pull up the game. There's the thing. Do you want this to change? Yes. And that's all you do. It's completely installed. And let's go ahead and look at the game and see if we can install it. Again, that is the little blue penguin, new species. I'm going to go ahead and make sure we get credit for him in the description. I'm going to pull the game now. All right, the zoo is pulled up now. I'm going to go ahead and change the perspective here so you guys can fully see. You see my screen's kind of cut, cut off. I do that for streaming because it zooms in a little bit closer. I'll go ahead and pull this up right now. All right, there we go. We got it pulled up right now. This is our zoo. So it's pretty straightforward. We might see a little bit of lag here because it is rather big. Uh, I don't want to spoil too much. We have two really large aquarium builds here going on. 
they're just completely done. I don't want to spoil what's in them. This is our big aquarium. It has stuff on the inside. Don't want to spoil it yet. We're going to be doing a walkthrough of my aquarium. But over here, right in front of our aquaria, the aquarium is our penguin exhibit. Now, this is a pretty cool exhibit. I'm really happy how it turned out. But I really want to add these little blue penguins into it. We'll go ahead and do that right now. So what you're going to do, nothing different from anything else. You hit your animals. You're going to go up here, set all filters. I think they're just blue penguins. I don't know if it's a little blue penguin or blue. Little blue penguin. Right here. Click on it, and bam, pulls them right up. There's sometimes issues. If there's any morphs, they'll pop up as a wallaby. I don't know why, but we do have a little blue penguin right here. If I click the wallabies, they, they still show up as the little blue peng penguin. They don't actually show up as wallabies, um, but just to be safe. We'll go ahead and take these silver ones as well. Go over here, reset. Little, oh, that's nice about little. Type in little blue penguin, and we have all of our little blue pet penguins going to select the ones that are showing as wallaby as well. They're not going to be wallabies. And we're going to experience a little bit of lag, so I'm going to hit play and fast forward until they are delivered. We're going to get a good view of that. Oh, lag, 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 lag. I need to turn the graph graphics down on this. Oh, here we go. Bam. And we hit pause. these guys right here. Now these are the albino versions of it. If you noticed, they are essentially a shrinked down version of this one. Very cute, very fun. There's a little bit of difference, but these are the albino versions of the little blue penguins. Obviously, the blue ones, let's see if we get one here. Oh, oh here we go. Come on guys. Bam, pause this. These are our little blue penguins, and that's how you install and put them into the mods. It's very, very cool. Cute little blue penguins. Uh, these are the rock hopper penguins that I downloaded as well, which I think we're all very used to seeing. And we also have our regular African penguins here as well. But let's go ahead and hit play. Let them get out to the exhibit a little bit. And let's just do a very, very quick walkthrough of our exhibit here. Of course, this is the front of our exhibit, right here. Very, very nice. Hit play. We have a nice little like overlook of the actual habitat itself. It's like we have some penguins walking up to get some sleep back here. Let's see, where are our little blue penguins? There's one right there. It looks like, I think we're gonna get a better view in the underwater view. So let's walk around here real quick. Let's walk around here. Oh, there's some. There's some right there. Let's go to our underwater area, which is actually right under our main boardwalk. There we go. And that is essentially it, guys. There's nothing really too crazy about it. There they are over here. Oh, come on, guys, dive. There we go. Oh, there's one of the rock guys, the rock hopper penguins. Very cool exhibit here. Really glad to add some more color. Uh, we have normal black, black and white, and kind of the brown ones. And so it's really cool to add these blue penguins in. I think it adds a lot uh, to this and the size difference. Very, very cool. Lots of movement's going to happen. But yeah, that is it, guys. We're, that ends the video. Pretty straightforward. Uh, if you have any questions, please post them in the comments below. Uh, and just if you want to go to share some photos, then you guys feel free to link them as well. But I'm going to put all the links to the different mods I've used today and all the links to the website and stuff in the description. So again, if you have any questions, comments, please put them in the comment section. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks. Bye.